Good morning, friends. This is what I woke up to hearing this morning. Hey there friends, welcome back to Lydia's Plates. So my dishwasher part has finally arrived. I'm super excited. This is all it is, this tiny little piece. There we go. It's just a little plastic piece with the right grooves to fit onto my impeller shaft. This little thing is called the impeller and now it's gonna take me maybe all five minutes to put it back together. As you saw already, we've got chicks being hatched here today and things are exciting and fun. But anyways, let's get this dishwasher fixed. So first I have to find all my screws. I had tucked them away so that they wouldn't get lost and I need to find them and remember which ones go where and then also find the tool that fits in there. You can see how worn that has gotten. And it's kind of junky in here. It's kind of gross. <laughs> One thing that I didn't get to saying here this day, because I only found out later when I actually wanted to start using the dishwasher again, is for some reason it didn't seem to want to wash. It seemed kind of stuck and I could hear the motor wanting to work, but it just wasn't going. So I came back into here and all of those screws that I put in around that smaller shroud, the one that goes on top of the big one, I loosened them all about a quarter of a turn and it's been working great ever since then. So I guess if it's too tight, it is possible to make it too tight, first of all. And if you make it too tight, then it seems like it can't spin. So after I loosen them off, it's been working great. So there we go. That's it. That's all there is to it. And I would have had it done in about the five minutes, like I said, if I hadn't put that together wrong the first time and remember to put the big round shroud in first. So it's that easy guys, it's really not difficult if your hubby's not home and you already know that that's what the problem is, the part comes in, you can easily do it yourself. It is that simple and anybody can do it. Now I can use the dishwasher again. So these are the eggs that we are starting to save for the next batch now. We want nice uniform eggs. They don't have to be 100% 100% identically perfect, but we do want a nice egg shape. We don't want very very dirty eggs. Like this one has a little bit right here, but that will be okay. That little bit won't bother. The instructions say to try to have it as uniform as possible to up your chances of a good hatch. The incubator came with very nice instructions, easy to read, very, very helpful. And we have not done everything perfectly, but we have still had good results the last time and we're hoping for good results this time. So this is very tricky to get a good shot. It almost seems like it's easier to get a good look at the eggs 
to sh if the light is shown from the opposite end of the incubator. Oh look, he's trying to help his buddy come out. So this is about four or five hours later and you can see it's very hard to see into there without any light shining in there. Spring seems to be around the corner, at least we are hoping that it is here. So it's burger season. We do barbecue over winter because we keep our barbecue in the garage, but it's just always so much more enjoyable when the weather gets warm as well. So we need to make burgers so that we have them ready to go in the freezer. Skittish. That one looked like it wanted to peck my camera. Peck my camera. Now they're getting curious. Can I they want to peck my camera. They're really getting their feathers in now. Wow. They look good. Alright, so here's the dark one. And she even has darker legs. I'm pretty sure this is a female. The females all seem to have shorter tail feathers. No, no quick movements, okay? Just nice and slow. Piggies. Hey, yeah, big, big pigs. Oh, look at you run. You're cute little pigs. Where'd the rooster go? I don't know. He'll be around there. There's he is. There he is. But right now we came to see the pigs. <laughs> yeah. Hey, pigs, we want to see your faces, not your butts. <laughs> hey, big, big, big. Come here, long ears. Come on, pigs. Come on. Come on, pig, 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 pig. Oh, there we go. Hello, pigs. Hey, pig, 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 pig. they don't know how to wave. Hey, pigs. Oh, hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. When's a Almost boy? good evening. Like... No, I think they're all girls this time. The other two must be hiding out in the barn. Yeah. I know, I told Dad that two of them were in the barn, two of them are out. Mm. <coughs> Maybe they switch positions. Yeah. Is that the one with the long snout that has the blue eye? One of these guys has a blue eye this time. I there think it, it is. is. It's that one. Yeah, it is too. Hey, pig, 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 pigs. <coughs> hey, pigs. Hey, pig, pig, pigs. Hey, pig, pig, pigs. Oh, that scared him. That's all it took. They're done coming. All right, Mr. Rooster, should we come see you? Hey there, Mr. Rooster. Protecting your girls. Oh, hello, kitty. Hey, meats. There you go. Oh, here comes another one. Hello, little stripe. Oh, and you. Hi, Buster. You're a big guy. 
<laughs> you wagging your tail on the barn. Hey there, Mr. Rooster. This is the nice one. The other one was vicious and chasing us, so we, we had to get rid of him. But this guy's a gentleman to the ladies. And he's a nice guy so far. Hey there, you. Hey, kitty. Oh, the girls are all happy. Cats are happy. How'd the chickens get in there again? I'm going to have to close that up. That's not cool. I have to get that red barn ready for meat birds again. They're coming in about two weeks. 75 of them again. Just yeah. One okay, one egg. Uh -huh, and two pigs. All right, two pigs. Well, let's not scare them. Oh, look, and they're sleeping. Oh, not sleeping. Just resting. Careful. Don't, don't scare them up. Hey, piggies. Hey, pig, pig, pigs. Hey there, pig, pig, pig. Show them the hey piggies, egg. can you show them the egg? Well, first we're looking at pigs. Hey pig pig. Do the pigs eat eggs? I don't know. I'm not interested in trying that. Hey piggy. Yes, hello. You kind of look like babe when you do that. One of them's trying to dig itself a tunnel out of the hay. Well, that's because the straw, it's straw, not hay. Hay is dried grass. Ah, uh, the straw is like his blanket. Let's see, where's your egg? You found an egg? Ooh, a nice one. Lucky Hang on, that is a nice egg. Only the one? Yeah. Well, that's okay, we got quite a few today already. Hey, little piggy nestled oh, in your blanket. Oh, oh, you guys are coming in, hello. They must be getting sleepy. Hello, pigs. Yeah, well, they are little. I'm sure oh, they need a lot of naps. I know one of them left to say, hey, the camera's over here, come look. <laughs> Now they're all going to run away. They're all camera shy. Pigs are often curious creatures. Hey, pig, pig, pig. Eat my hand. Ooh, it's curious about my hand. What's it going to do to your phone? All right. Oh, See you later, piggies.